Hey, what's going on everybody? So, Jeff Holiday here. I wanted to make a quick little video uh, to talk about some things that are going to be happening relatively soon, especially in Meat Space, and then also just kind of the direction of my channel in and of itself. Now, the first thing I want to say is you should probably mark down on your calendars April 21st to the 22nd in Phoenix, Arizona, which is the perfect time to be in Phoenix, because Phoenix in, in the summer is awful, it's hot, it's just god-awful. But in April, most states suck. They're not very warm, kind of shitty, but in Phoenix, it's going to be like 80 degrees. It's going to be amazing. Perfect time to have a convention. The name of the convention is the Kilroy Event, and it is it's marketed as first and foremost a free speech conference, uh, a, a way for a lot of some of your favorite YouTube creators to get together and to talk about some things. And so far, right now, mostly it's people who have done videos kind of similar to me, um, especially like in the uh, the social criticism realm of YouTube. Uh, lots of speakers. I'm going to be a speaker. It's going to be interesting. Me and Nick, uh, aka the Wizard of Cause, we're going to be doing our live show, the YouTube Saints, live from the convention, or at least close to the convention on that Saturday night or that Sunday night. And it's going to be it's going to be a great time. It's going to be absolutely incredible. I'm really looking forward to it. Now, as of right now, if you go to KilroyEvent.com, you can see where the fundraiser is at. As of the time of this recording, we're at 49.6% of it being funded. And it's only been going for like a week. So this is happening. It's happening. And everybody's really stoked for it. So I, I it's going to be a good time. I've already got uh, my tickets purchased and everything. Really looking forward to it. It's going to be great. Going to be amazing. Hopefully we get some contrary points of view. Some people who do not necessarily make the same type of content as we do. So we can have some interesting panels where we can debate and discuss and maybe even have some good old fashioned arguments. But we'll see. The second thing I wanted to touch on is me and Memory are going to be up in the Seattle area this next weekend. Yes, absolutely. We're going to be up there. Uh, we're going mostly for family purposes, but while we're up there, we're going to be having a meetup. So on the 25th of November at 4 p.m. at the Seattle Center is where we're going to be meeting. If anybody wants to come out and hang out with us, if we get a chance to, maybe we can hang out further later on. But that's like a big open area where anybody can like show up. We can hang out. We can talk. Uh, you can meet me. I'm actually really friendly in real life. I promise. Um, but I think we'll probably be somewhere near the fountain. Should be pretty easy to find. I'll have one of my stupid ass hats on. Come find me. Come give me a big old hug. And we'll have a grand old time. It'll be great. Now, the last thing that I wanted to mention, this is kind of off the cuff. I don't really have anything scripted, but I wanted to talk a little bit about my channel. Now, I'm really proud of how far I've come in YouTube. But at the same time, I kind of recognize that there are certain things that have gotten in my way in the direction I've wanted to take my channel. Now, when I first started YouTube, I mostly was doing anti-pseudoscience videos, and I got kind of drawn into a lot of the politics because the politics of identity politics was starting to infect the places of science that I really love. And somewhere along, along the way, that became more of the focus that I was really putting my attention towards. Now, don't get me wrong. Identity politics are still really important. Uh, regressive ideas, uh, the rise of far-right identitarian practices, these are things that I don't agree with, and I am still going to talk about them, but it's going to be a lot less frequent. Instead, I would like to kind of get back a little bit more focused on the science, on predatory nature of people. I'd also really like to start getting back into the things that meant so much to me in doing YouTube, which is... Uh, exposing things that are that are huge problems in society, things like uh, the predation of children, uh, human trafficking, uh, uh, the stigma surrounding things like mental illness, etc, etc, etc. And on top of that, I really want to increase my production level because I find that if I'm not trying to innovate and do something new and fun, that it kind of starts to lose its flavor. So that's why I started doing things like recently I made a video with Hemlock Moonwolf, a character uh, that was a lot of fun to do. I want to do something more than just simply a, even though I have like a green screen and you see me and I am performing, I want to do something more involved. And 
that's really where I want to focus on it. Because if YouTube's not fun for me, it's not going to be fun for you to watch me. And I want to have that reciprocal nature between what I'm doing and what you're experiencing. Part and parcel of that too is, I need to stop being so abrasive in other people's live streams. Probably a good idea. So yeah, that's a basic idea of where I'm, uh, where I'm coming from, where I'd like to go in the future. I love YouTube. I am never going to stop. I think it's probably one of the best things that's ever happened to me and my family. Now, if you're one of those lovely, lovely people who has been subscribed to this channel, but you don't know there are other channels that I do operate on and the other things that I do, uh, I do have a secondary channel, which I try to contain most of the drama or like uh, stream of consciousness rants and stuff on. I have a culture channel, which I'm trying to be more active on, where I talk about, you know, movies and comic books and things like that. Stuff that I consume as a massive geek. And then on top of that, I also have my weekly show, which is actually a twice a week show. We do one on Twitch and one on the YouTube channel. And it's basically like our version of a late night show. It's called the YouTube Saints that I do with my buddy Wizard of Cause, aka Nick. And we've been having a lot of fun with that. We do it every single week on Sundays on the YouTube channel and usually on Thursdays on the Twitch channel. And it's a lot of fun. Great live shows. We try and, and, and showcase people's art, uh, people's music, and feature smaller YouTubers so that you can broaden your horizons and find more interesting people to watch. So by all means, please check all these things out. Last but not least, I want to say a big thank you to everybody out there, all the people who've been watching me, uh, to my patrons, to my family who've been very understanding, uh, to my friends, to my fellow YouTubers who've been very, very kind. It's been an incredible experience so far. I Words fail me to express my gratitude, but it has been a wild ride, and I can't wait to see what next year is going to bring. It's going to be insane, so... Stick with me. I'll stick with you. Hopefully I don't let you down. We'll see how it goes. Have a great day. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.